Hello, everybody. Yes. Hello, everybody. What's going on here? It's me. And hey, we are started. Yes, we can speak like this or maybe like this. You can choose your destiny right now. Yes, and we will talk about some moments in my life and about our English journey, our progress. I want to say that mechanical writing mechanical by your hand is so powerful tool yes it's maybe not really amazing and the best tool but it's powerful why why do i think like this why do i think like this let's talk about it by the way, hello everybody, Angel, hello Lucy, hello everybody, hello Whale, uh, Medic and other happy bus to King Father, everybody, hello, yes. And right now I'm gonna talk about it and uh, it will be interesting, yes, and uh, okay, how, how to say it, uh, is in the Russian if we will uh, translate uh, one phrase it will be let's put our uh, words to the side yes it's like a no nothing nothing of this uh, trash talk let's talk specific specific without some will be specific specific and special this uh, can how to say it can critica in the Russia how to like how to say it in your is will be can critica it will be specifics specifics yes right now will be specifics what do I mean? If you will learn daily three hours at least or maybe how how do you like how you like you can do this yes and if you you will do three hours of learning per, per day a day you will be great why do I think like this? Because you will practice also your mechanical technique, mechanical, motorical, how to say it, uh, motorics. One moment. Matility, matility, sorry. Matility you will improve. Matility with these simple actions, yes. And also, uh, it is good to... It is good way to improve English. Because you will write it. And writing is slower than speaking, yes. You can speak like a faster uh, bullet, bullet gun. Or how to say it correct. And uh, it will be like a, you could use your hand trying to get it off of your foot. It will be faster like an American speech, trying to, de trying to get it off of your foot. Trying to get it off of foot, your foot. Trying to get it off of, trying to get it off of your foot. It's, oh Jesus, it's so fast, yes. But if you will write it, you, you could use your hand trying to get it off of uh, your food. It will be more slowly, yes? Understand me? That uh, if you will write all your sentences, what's hard for you right now, yes? Maybe hard. Hard sentences for you, pronunciation, hard pronunciation right now, but it will be easier step by step, yes? Daily. And uh, <laughs> if you will practice it slowly with your hand, you will understand it more correct, in more correct form. Yes, it will be correctly looking, correctly looking grammar. You will choose, you will, you will do this correct, yes. What's more, you can also write 
by your hand 50 questions uh, of something 50 questions 50 different questions can you teach soft skills what are your top five skills what personal skills can i improve on what are professional soft skills what are the six uh, soft skills what are the motor skills what uh, are something else yes this what i want to do what i wanted to say and i have new format is study with me and while how to say it uh, yeah while i do this the more i do study with me the more i practice my opportunities the more i motivate you to do the same maybe in your own way it's like uh, you can do the same thing but you will improve your own skills yes and your own opportunity to improve self uh, why did i started this why did i start this format it's question here and why did i start because i uh, i understood that no i was watching videos yes on youtube and looking to the look at it at videos and oh jesus this person practices practice eight hours in a row and I oh Jesus Christ it's so many and uh, no it's not really many it's like uh, oh Jesus uh, every day every day every day and uh, it's good and I want to do this too because uh, somebody else practice practices more than than me oh Jesus it's it's not fair. Let's crash it. Let's <laughs> wake up at <laughs> 5 a.m. and start our day with a full uh, baggage of opportunities. Yes, and possibilities. And I decided to do this format. Also, maybe will be work with me and exercise with me. Like I do right now sports, e.g. sports. Yes, and this video about uh, why why should you start uh, writing by hand? Because uh, it will improve your skills too. It uh, will be conversation with yourself. Conversation with we can create conversation with ourselves. Jesus, it's so <laughs> too high. I feel so high. I feel too high after this cannabis, or how to say it, uh, cannabis, uh, Mary, Mary Jane. Yes, it's uh, it's choking because I was watching video one one video about Mary Jane and about one girl when she was talking and uh, she was talking like, uh, I feel so high. I feel too high like this, and I'm have never used uh, Mary Jane and I don't want to do this. Yes, but <laughs> it was funny, really, you know. Okay. But thank you so much for watching today's video. Yes, improve yourself daily, don't forget about it. And don't forget to learn new skills, soft skills, also other skills, professional skills. And step by step, I want to learn English syllables, cutie words, Else, uh, how to say it? Uh, syllables. Yes, I wrote it. Could do words and phrases. How to say it? Is uh, expressions. Cool. It's expressions. Yeah, we will learn it daily, step by step. Why? Should I learn English syllables? Because if I will know English syllables, I will like that. I will detect this part, this part, this part, this part, how to pronounce it. By the way, let me know. Let me know. We have its example. Let me know is a phrase, yes, expression. Let me know. And you can say, let me know. Like a fast, fast, like a supersonic speed, you can speak it, you can say it. Or maybe 
Like I said before, trying, trying to get it off of your food. You could use your hand trying to get it off of your food. Trying to get it off of your food. It's so hard to understand to me right now. Like, uh, trying to get it off of your food is so fast. For example, what's more? We can learn. Like, uh, don't, don't even. Don't even. Don't do not even. Yes? And uh, in American speakers is so fast speaking like this. Don't even. Cause when a word or syllable ends in NT in American English, it is common to pronounce just N. For example, I can eat that. It's like I can't. I cannot eat that. Or I wouldn't argue with him about it. It will be I wouldn't I would not argue with him about it. I wouldn't I wouldn't argue with him about it. Or international international, yes? International international but container pun pantry entertainment. Why? Because uh, it begins the syllable. Yes, do pronounce it. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time and don't forget to improve this. Improve your skills daily. By the way, some of the not really big problems with skin, but I don't know what is. Need to improve our skin. Yes, we will do this. Thanks so much for watching again. See you next time. Don't forget to cling to your road of success. Don't forget to reach your banana, your peach, or something else. Be cool, improve so daily. Yes, our journey is continuing. Bye bye. Yes, it was maybe 106 uh, episode of the EG English learning. 